Okay, I'm just gonna give you guys a quick uh, overview of my new test tank I have here. Um, I got this test tank uh, March 27th. Um, I just uh, actually I got the barrel, but I had to make the tank itself, uh, put the wood on and stuff. But um, the base container is a 55-gallon plastic drum. Um, and then what I did is I used the sawzall to cut about half of the top off, and uh, and what that allows me to do is have a motor in here and so I can rev the motor up a little bit without all the water splashing out. Um, the transom board is a piece of uh, 2 by 8 wood um, and then I have it bolted on with 4 quarter, um, quarter inch uh, stainless steel bolts and then I have um, large quarter inch flat washers on the outside as well as on the inside and I also have quarter 20 um, nylock nuts um, to hold everything together um, I have about 45 gallons of water in it now and it seems that seems to be a good level um, for running motors at because it will, be, so you can have the pump housing under water, um, as well as just have, have enough water to run the motor in. Um, I'm going to try to keep it filled up pretty much all year now, just so I can use less water. Because normally when I would use a trash can, I'd dump it out every time and waste 30 gallons of water. And uh, this also doubles as a mosquito killing device because of all the unburnt oil that floats on the surface of the water. And as soon as the mosquitoes, if they land on that though, they're going to hit that and then they're going to die. So it'll be mosquito control as well. So uh, thanks for watching. Bye.